Cycling is very good for society. The Dutch approach to cycling can help achieve accessibility, livability, sustainability and health goals. The 17 million Dutch own almost 23 million bicycles and a quarter of all trips nationwide are made by bicycle. Still, the Dutch government wants to get another 200,000 commuters out of their car and onto their bicycles. In their new program called Dutch Cycling, the Dutch Cycling Embassy explains why that is such a good idea. Cycling is inexpensive. For people, the annual costs of riding a bike is approximately 300 euros, whereas the annual cost of driving a car is approximately 8,500 euros. And for society, a kilometer covered by bicycle yields a social benefit of 68 euro cents, whereas buses cost society 29 cents per kilometer traveled and cars 37 euro cents. Cyclists spend more in local shops. Although cyclists spend less per visit, they spend more overall because they shop more often than people driving. Cycling is also good for the environment. Not only does the product life cycle of a bicycle generate minimal carbon emissions, the local air quality improves drastically when people switch from cars to bicycles. It reduces 65% nitrogen oxide per kilometer traveled. Public space is improved by turning car space into people space. This improves the local environment. Cycling is silent and helps to reduce traffic noise. Riding a bicycle is a healthy, fun and low-impact form of exercise for all ages. Employees cycling to work are less likely to call in sick. Cycling keeps you fit longer and your immune system young. Cycling regularly boosts physical fitness and prolongs life expectancy by 3 to 14 months. Cycling 30 minutes every day is equivalent to the weekly recommended level of physical activity. It also reduces the risk of serious diseases and depression. 40% less for cancer, 52% less for heart diseases and over 40% less for premature death. Cycling makes you happy. 59% of all cyclists associate cycling with joy and only 2% dislike cycling. Dutch children are the happiest in the world. Cycling allows them to reach destinations safely and gives them the feeling of freedom. Cycling improves the quality of life. It is associated with convenience, independence, flexibility and always arriving on time. Cycling creates public space. Bicycles take up less space than cars, both for driving and in the amount of space taken up by parking. Where you can park one car, you can park 10 bicycles. Within the urban environment, locations are easier to reach by bicycle or a combination of bicycle and public transport than by car. Cycling saves you time. Without the need to search for a parking spot, the bicycle is the fastest means of transportation within the urban environment. Separating cyclists from motorized traffic results in fewer accidents and cycling cities have fewer casualties among cyclists. Developing a clear road safety program reduced 1600 traffic casualties between 1998 and 2007 in the Netherlands. Lower traffic speeds result in fewer deadly accidents. The likelihood of a deadly accident at speeds 30 km per hour or less is approximately 75% less than at 50 km per hour. Cycling encourages social participation. Cycling requires social interaction with other road users to mediate traffic flows or to prevent collisions. As a result, cycling is experienced as a social activity. Cycling keeps the elderly socially connected and active for longer. The Dutch believe their approach to cycling can be applied in other countries too. Cities and regions around the world 
can benefit from Dutch experience. Dutch cycling could also improve your quality of life. <laughs>